I was, I was totally shocked, like everyone else would have been. And then, did you? What was your response to, to the person that you know of, Eddie McGuire? Did no, it's not the re no, it's not the response of how I know Eddie McGuire. It's the response of how I know Adam Goods. I had the very, very good fortune to tour Ireland with a, a team, and I was cap uh, coach that side, and I was able to make my decision in terms of captain. And I was very fortunate to have Adam as the captain of the Australian side. So I know the quality of the person. I also know the quality of him as a leader within a group. Uh, we took 23 players away, and if I'm reading it right from the AFL point of view, they said uh, those that had travelled time and time again said it was the closest nip knit group that had toured ever. And we won those games, and I think we won those games because of we weren't, it's not as if we were better than the Irish, we were very closely knit, and we were knit together because Adam is a very caring person. So when that took place, I was not thinking of who delivered it. I was thinking of more the consequences of the way, in my brief association with Adam Goods, how he would take that on board. And more importantly, did he take it on board for himself or did he take it on board for fellow people who would be affected by it? And I have no doubt he would be wearing the, uh, those comments for all Indigenous people people who, or anyone who, who was offended by those remarks. Were you hurt for Adam Goods? I felt very sorry for Adam Goods. With just on Eddie, you've worked with him obviously for a long period of time, you know him better than anyone in here. Do you agree with the theory that one, and it was a big mistake, but one mistake shouldn't undo the years and years of, of good work that he's done in this field? Of oh, I, I've no comment there. That, that's, you know, we, we're going to make someone a victim out of this. Eddie's not a victim. It is not the victim in this. The, vic the victim is the fact that we... we listen, to, listen to what uh, Harry O'Brien has said. Listen to what Adam Goods has said. I don't think any of us... The, the thing is that I get very, very annoyed at here. No, we, we don't walk in some other people's shoes. Sometimes we, we need to, to walk in someone else's shoes and find out what it's really like. You know, I, I, had, I, have, I, had the, uh, I have the history, I suppose, of growing up with some Indigenous people coaching and playing, then coaching. And I've seen the other side. I've seen the ugly side. And, and we, we have got a long, long way to go. And this, this all that's happened, over, from my point of view, has happened this week, is, is a reinforcement that we are too tolerant of ignorance. We are too tolerant of, of the, of, uh, it's OK, Jack, I'm OK. But we've got to put ourselves in the shoes of others and find out how we, as a, as a nation, have got to improve, both at school, both through politics, at sport, uh, everyday living. And, and, and the, the victims are this, Adam Goods and, and what he represents. And, vic and, we are, and the victim of, we are the victims of thinking that we, everything's OK we're right, we've got it all under control. We have not got that under control. And that is, that is unfortunate, that is, is shocking, and I think that it's easy for me to talk about it, but it's far harder for Harry O'Brien's and these guys to talk about it because they've been, they've been in that position before, and it's now, hopefully, something will come out of this as a positive right the way through. What about your guys here, Eddie, Jeff and... Uh, I, I, haven't spoke, I have not spoken about it. So you're not aware if they've had any particular... Uh, oh, yes, I am. Yeah, yeah. What, you think they're immune to it? No, no, I, I, can, no. I won't go there because I don't think those players want that, um, that publicity. But I do know that um, right through my football time that those, these things are not isolated. Uh, I, I, would, I would say no, but at his own admission, he said it was a racist comment, at his own admission.